I thoroughly enjoy it and I've been coming here for 21 of the 22 years this event's been going. We've raised quite a lot of money from the kindness of not only the sponsors and those who have, like NCBA today, they're the main sponsor of the event. We've had Safaricom, we've had a number of other people. The raffle, the kindness of people who've donated prizes and of course the people who donate their time to come here. Dobies may be selling cars, but they come every year. Bombolulu's been here every year and it helps them to promote themselves. It's good, it's good fun and people should enjoy it. And Covid hit us badly, but here we go, we're back to normal, nearly. I've been here since 7 o'clock in the morning and uh, you can see I'm really enjoying it. So uh, I hope everybody else who is out there should be coming here. What are your future plans for tournaments like this? Oh, this, this, this event, we are going nowhere because we are here, we've been here 16 years. So we are not stopping now. We'll still be here to support uh, this uh, event. As you know, this event um, uh, raises a lot of funds to support a lot of charities. There's a lot of, uh, we have palliative care that we are doing, we have children's home that we are doing, we have hospitals within Diani that we are doing. So this is not just um, a family fund day, but we raise funds to support uh, charitable uh, uh, events uh, within the Diani family. So we are very happy as NCBA that uh, plays part of our core our, our, our core pillars in terms of um, working with our communities wherever we are present. This year we've, d we've done bingo and we've done uh, wild wheels and our goat derby is our real um, thing which we do a lot of charity for many people and we've got lots of helpers and lots of pretty people to be judged on um, dress and what have you and then this time round we're having a tuk-tuk parade see who's going to win the tuk-tuk and we're going to try and ask them a few questions on how to drive a tuk-tuk.